Hello, today we're going to be talking about opioids. So, what are opioids? Opioids are substances made from the opium poppy or their man made equivalents. The poppy was cultivated in Mesopotamia and spread to every major civilization from Asia to Europe to treat pain. There are two classes of opioids strong opioids, which include phenethyl, methadone, morphine, and oxycodone, and weak opioids, which include codeine, dihydrocodeine, and tramadol. The strong opioids can be 10 times stronger than the weakest opioid and are thus more effective for severe pain. Worldwide, it is estimated 69,000 people die from opioid overdose each year, with 15 million suffering from an opioid addiction. Opioid overdoses occur when high doses are used. This can lead to inadequate breathing and death. Opioid addiction is the frequent use of opioids to the harm of the person's physical, psychological, and social function, and it becomes central to their thoughts, emotions, and activities. If opioids are used regularly, a physical dependence forms, and they will experience withdrawal symptoms after stopping opioid use. These include strong cravings, sweating, insomnia, anxiety, and muscle cramps. So why do people use opioids? Because it is an effective way for managing the two types of pain, neuropathic pain and nociceptive pain. Neuropathic pain is pain in the body that occurs from nerve injuries from trauma, cancer, or neurological diseases such as Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. The second type of pain is nociceptive pain. This is pain arising from tissue injury and inflammation such as toothaches, sunburn, and rheumatoid arthritis. The use of opioids produces pain relieving effects including pain suppression, relaxation, drowsiness, and euphoria. It stimulates the reward centers in the brain for the release of dopamine neurons which regulate feelings of pleasure. The speed and intensity of the drug's effect depends on how the drug is taken. If taken orally, the effects are gradual and are felt in about 10 to 20 minutes. If injected into a vein, the effects are more intense and felt in about a minute. When opioids are taken to relieve pain, the length of the effect varies depending on the type of opioid taken and history of opioid use. For many, a single dose can provide pain relief for about 4 to 5 hours. A single dose for chronic pain relief is about 200 mg per day. Adverse events and side effects occur with increasing dosage or with daily doses of 300 mg per day or more. These side effects include constipation, decrease in breathing, difficulty concentrating, vomiting, sweating, and loss of appetite. Additionally, opioid users can develop tolerance. This is a reduction in sensitivity to opioids following repeated use. This means higher doses are required to produce the same effect of pain relief. So. What treatment options are available for those of opioid dependence? In order for treatment to be effective, a diverse range of options are needed. This includes detoxification in combination with both psychological and pharmacological treatments. Treatment for opioid overdose includes naloxone, which completely reverses the effect of an opioid overdose by blocking opioids from binding to receptors in the brain. However, this will only work if naloxone is administered on time. For more information on opioids, please check out the Center for Addiction and Mental Health and McMaster University National Pain Center.